What is involved in using a mathematical scale? Hi, I'm Jimmy, and we're here to discuss exactly how to use a mathematical scale. Now, the important thing first to understand is a scale is a comparison as to what is being drawn or what the model is compared to the actual size. So, for example, if you see a 1 to 12 ratio, that means that the model that you've drawn and the actual size of the real thing is that the actual size of the model is 12 times larger than that of the model itself. So what we're going to talk about today is some things to look for when it comes to using a scale. And the first thing is be familiar with the scale. There are two kinds of scales, an architect scale and an engineer scale. And each scale is going to have the different kinds of markings. So you just want to be sure as to what scale you want to use. Now, just as a friendly reminder, an architect scale and an engineer scale are three-sided. We're used to using rulers that are two-sided, but a scale is actually three-sided, kind of like a triangle. Again, because different scales, whether it be an architect scale or an engineer scale, are different, they're going to have different markings. So just re-examine the markings just so you know exactly what it is that uh, you want to use. And last but not least, once you've figured out the markings, it's time to determine the scale that you want to draw and then make the drawings that fit that ratio accordingly. So, I'm Jimmy, and this has been How to Understand a Mathematical Scale.